Hey guys, how are you? Long time no see. I hope that everybody is doing well and is safe and healthy during this pandemic. And so I thought what other time than to show you my favorite items that I'm loving right now while we're all locked inside. And most of these items are items that I've loved for a while and I've um, rediscovered. <laughs> or there's a few new items. So I've broken it up into um, beauty, food, workout, entertainment, and kind of like miscellaneous. But I'll start off with the beauty stuff first. So I love getting my nails done, but obviously that is not an option right now. So I've been in love and I'm not wearing them right now because I was just making sourdough bread. So I opted not to make them, but I've been loving these um, press on nails. I've been obsessed with them. These ones are from LA Colors. I found these at Walmart for like $3.50. And then these ones were a little bit more, they're like $5 and they're amazing. Like you usually get 20, 24 to 30 nails depending on the pack and you just stick them on. They come with the glue, they come with the little nail filer and it's life changing. I don't even know if after this, if I'm going to go back to the salon because these are so easy and so convenient and you could just keep the glue in your purse. If one pops off, you could just grab a whole new one or like if a few aren't looking that great you just soak it off with acetone and change those ones out so i really have been in love with these and i think i'm gonna probably just get like regular manicures after this is done and then just like stick these on myself because they look great and they're so inexpensive another beauty item i've been loving are masks and i'll start off with the kind of weird one is a foot mask so i've been waiting to do a foot mask for a while because when you do these foot masks, basically your feet peel for two weeks. And what better time to do it than when we can't leave the house. So these baby foot masks, you just kind of put your feet in these little bags and after a few weeks, they start to peel. So you can get these on Amazon. I'll try to link everything that I can. I know Amazon doesn't have a lot of stuff but um, right now, but I'll try to link like what I could find. And then the next thing I have are face masks and I have an expensive option and an option that's less expensive more affordable this is the drunk elephant tlc sukari baby facial um, it's 25 percent aha 2 percent bha this is a cult favorite it's amazing but it's 80 dollars um you just put this on your face for like 5 10 minutes oh this one is 20 minutes um and yeah then you, i swear just like kind of like resurfaces your face helps with pores helps with acne it helps with everything i love this stuff but if you don't want to spend like 80 dollars on this you can get one by the ordinary it's 30 percent aha so five percent more than the drug elephant and two percent bha which is the same thing as the drug elephant this one you don't keep on for more than 10 minutes usually i only keep this one on for like five minutes because it's so intense but they are essentially pretty much the exact same thing i own both and i don't think i'll be getting the drunk elephant one again i think the drunk elephant one's like it's a little bit more moisturizing it's more of a creamy formula where this one's more liquidy but yeah if you're looking for like a good like aha mask these are both the bomb and you can get the ordinary on sephora now okay going into food <laughs> this is a new discovery of mine uncrustables chocolate flavored hazelnut so it's basically nutella i was never allowed to have uncrustables when i was a little girl my mom always made me eat like healthy foods and she never saw the point of something like this but I recently wanted to try them a few weeks ago. No, it was, might have been like a month or two ago, actually. Maybe two months ago. And I was like, let me give these a go. And now I'm obsessed with them. And yeah, like they are like in plastic, which isn't great. And I can make a sandwich myself, but I never buy white bread like this. And if I had a thing of Nutella in the house, that would just be madness. So a four pack of these lasts me like a month or even longer, maybe two months because I only have them as like a little treat. So it's just nice to have something like this so that I don't have to buy a full loaf of bread. And I don't know, something about the texture of these. These are, I've been missing out my whole life because they're so good. The other thing I've been loving is my French press. I use it with this Ile Brown brand um, coffee. It's just coffee grinds. And yeah, I've been loving my little like French press next to my computer while I'm working at home. You could use this to make cold brew coffee. All you do is put the coffee grinds in, put cold water into it, and then just put it in the fridge overnight with, while it's not pressed down. Just leave it like that. And then 
um, in the morning you just press it down and you have cold brew so you don't have to pay like five dollars a cup at Starbucks anymore like just make it at home yourself and then aside from my cold brew my Nespresso machine I've been obsessed with specifically this caramel cookie flavor um, it's so good these were formulated to be used with milk which I love almond milk in my coffee and it's just great while cafes aren't open I could just like make my own latte at home so I know that the Nespresso is like a higher priced um, machine if you don't have that, but you can get deals on them all the time. I think I got mine for like $99 back um, on like Black Friday or something like that. And if not, this is just as good. If not, sometimes better. It just depends on my mood, but I love the cold press. You should, or French press, the, the cold press coffee that I make with it. Okay, now for some fun stuff, entertainment. <laughs> So, <laughs> I've had a Nintendo 3DS for a while now, I'm obsessed with it, and so I decided to whip it out and start playing some games again. The games that I had um, were Animal Crossing New Leaf, classic, so much fun, and then the other game I had was Mario Party Island Tour, which is also a lot of fun, but then I saw that they had this Super Mario Brothers 2. I don't know how new it is, it says new on there. But it's new to me, although it's just like the classic game on like Nintendo 64 or whatever the Nintendo original was. It's like that. So the back has like really fun examples of how the games are. And yeah, it just brought me back to like my childhood in the 90s. Um, this is a lot of fun. <laughs> and it's just like kind of fun to have something that makes you happy so you can get your mind off of like all of this negativity I've been really enjoying these like little children cartoony games yeah they make me happy <laughs> on the side of not children are books right now i'm reading talking to strangers by malcolm gladwell i really love it so far i'm a big history buff so his books are amazing i can't wait to finish that and then since we all cannot go out to um get books right now I wanted to tell you guys about an app that I really love. It's called overdrive.com. It's completely free. And basically what you do is it links you to your local um, library, public library. So for me, I can go to the Los Angeles Public Library's site on there. You get a electronic library card and you can check out books from the, the library in like your city for free. It literally like checks them out for 21 days for you and then it checks them back in for you so you don't even have to worry about late fees. Sometimes like if it's a really popular book, it'll take you like a few weeks to get it. But for the most part, there's always something on there to read. You can um, rent out a ridiculous amount of books at a time. And yeah, that's awesome. I have a bunch of books on my iPhone. Um, I'm reading a few books by Dr. Joe Dispenza and they also even have um, eBooks. I'm sorry, not ebooks. <laughs> Obviously, they have ebooks. E they have um, audiobooks as well. So, if you wanted to listen to a book while, I don't know, you're cooking or something at home, then you could do that. I have one more beauty item. I totally forgot to share this with you guys, but it's the Kosas Tinted Face Oil. This is basically a foundation that is an oil. Like, it is an oil. And I feel like you could get up to full coverage with this. It's crazy, but it has a bunch of like vitamins and nutrients. It's actually good for your skin. Um, you can get it at Sephora. I've been obsessed with it. It's nice because I don't like to look like a complete bum at home. I don't look great right now, but you know, on most days I try to at least get ready for work and look a little bit better. Just it makes you, me feel better personally. And yeah, I like to get ready for myself. So you know what? This is perfect, it's a face oil, it has like a bunch of nutrients in it. Just make sure to set this with powder or you will look like an oil ball. They say you don't need to set this and I feel like you definitely do and everyone who I've talked to who has this has said they needed to, to set it. Okay, so now I have a few miscellaneous items. The first one is my booty band. I don't think I really need to say anything about this. I'm sure everybody knows what this is. I do home workouts. It's great. I bought a pair of weights, which have been awesome. They're only 20 pounds each, but you know what? They get the job done. And I have a little bike, which I'll put a little clip in right now so you can see my bike. It's by uh, Sunny. I got it at Target a few months ago for like 180 bucks, and it's honestly been 
the greatest thing I've ever purchased. The best $180 I've ever purchased. And I'll put a little clip in right now. <laughs> Okay guys, so don't mind my couch that my cat completely scratched up, but this is the bike. And it's by the brand Sunny. Sorry, what place is kind of... And what I did was it comes with regular, um, regular cages, but what I did was I bought the little clips and then just put my spin shoes right into it. It can go like tighter. So that you have like more resistance. The chair is pretty comfy. I saw people complain about it, but I think they just didn't set it up right. And yeah, I honestly love this little bike. It's like worth every single penny and it's pretty compact. Like I can really easily just move it into a closet or like into my bedroom, which I really like. It doesn't always live right here. Okay, the next item is for my cat Tofu. He is a Siamese cat, and he is just like the fluffiest cat ever. And so I found this brush. It's called Pet Meat. And it almost just looks like a rake for your cat. And I swear to God, when I brush him with this, well, one, he loves it. Like, he will sit there for 10 minutes with me just, like, brushing him. But I will get, like... A whole nother cat out of my cat like that's how much hair comes off of him it's crazy and it's been amazing because it's shedding season and I do want not want my apartment filled with hair and I feel like it's just so sad when I can see the hairs falling off of him like brush your kitties guys if you have fluffy kitties and this has been great it's so much better than the last brush I had I got it off Amazon I'll link it below it's called pet me and the last thing that I've been loving is this little device so basically what you do is you can connect this onto a table and then you can just like clip your iPhone for it. I have an iPhone 11 plus and it clips right in. You could put this next to your bed so you could like watch movies or read books on it um, with your overdrive app. I'll link that below by the way. Um, or you could even use it to film videos. I mean, you could just do so much with this. I got it on Amazon. It's been great. You can like adjust it every which way. Um, it tightens obviously so it like locks in place so it could fit on like um, different like thickness of like tables. But yeah, this has been awesome and I love it. Well, that is everything you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And comment down below what your favorite items have been that have been keeping you busy or things that you've rediscovered that you love during this quarantine because maybe maybe just maybe we can keep each other entertained and spread a little bit of joy but anyway thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys next time bye